In this video, we'll show you how we installed this cabinet cooler onto this electrical panel. All of the relays and switches were overheating, causing a malfunction in the machine, and this cabinet cooler will provide a solution by keeping it cool and dry. To install this cabinet cooler, we need a drill to make a pilot hole. Then we'll ream that out and we'll use this electrical knockout tool. This will make a one and a half inch NPS hole for us to install this cabinet cooler. To make the hole, we'll use this electrical knockout tool. This will cut the perfect size hole for the cabinet cooler. Now we'll remove the lock nut from the cabinet cooler and install the cabinet cooler into the hole that we just made. All that's left is to feed this with compressed air and connect our cold air distribution kit.